So you can see seven months after establishing the native plants and after two hand weedings during that time period that compared to the untreated control, these native ground covers have done an excellent job in weed control by stabilizing the plot. So this is the Naupaka treatment which is established very well uh, in these seven months. But uh, out of the native plant species, this one had the most difficulty competing the weeds, including my nemesis, the spiny amaranth. The Nanea has done very well. In fact, you can see how it's actually grown over into the crop rows where I have the black plastic down. So this may serve as a challenge when we start to integrate the vegetable crop. Now, peely grass was slow to establish. But uh, after seven months, we can see that it has really assumed dominance in these plots and with very little weed competition. The Ahuava, which is the other monocot, the sedge functional group, is still the clear winner uh, in being able to occupy and exclude weeds from competing within this site. So here we're in the vine functional group. The Nanea, which is encroaching into the crop row, which may be a challenge when establishing the vegetables. However, we see with the monocots being a bunch type, here the Ahuava, and in the foreground here the Peely grass, establishing dominance in the row, but not encroaching into the crop row. 